the sort of the features of AR kit. So the camera uses uh, the sensors to track a plane here. Mm -hmm. Now that it has a plane tracked, I can just add objects. Yes. So I can put a cup right there, move it around, interact with it. <laughs> and then I can add other objects like a lamp. And I can actually use light and shade. You see the light, uh, yeah, yeah, I see. and you see the shadows on the uh, yeah, cup there. Oh, that's good. Interact, yeah. So keep adding a few other objects, like a vase here. Mm -hmm. So you can imagine the kinds of experiences that uh, developers yeah, yeah. can build with this. So there's a quick demo app I can show you. Mm -hmm. Is uh, Star Wars Hollow uh, Chest here? Mm -hmm. So it just uh, has to grab onto the surface here. Uh, there you go. And now I've got my game board there, and you see it's in the real world, it's sitting on the table. Mm -hmm. And uh, you can see, if you go in deep here, see the uh, sort of reflections right on there. All the detail. Mm -hmm. And then you can really just interact with some of these, uh, you know, so I can place this guy over here. Yeah, yeah, sure. And you can actually just play an interactive game like that. Yeah. So. You can imagine, this is a very simple example of it, but you can imagine the sorts of things that, you know, with Pokemon Go and some of these other apps, I can uh, really take advantage of this. Everything is now part of the gameplay. There's the surfaces, it's not just floating in the middle of the air. Yeah, 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 sure. So, that's sort of a brief glimpse.